All right, fantastic. Joined by Scotty Scheffler, Tommy Fleetwood, Colin Morikawa. I'm Chris Trott with Team TaylorMade. Straight away, we've got Colin messing around with a brand new putter, the Spider GT Max. Tell us what you've seen on the bottom there and what you're doing and why. And we're having a great conversation, which is exactly right. Yeah, there's some adjustable weights um, just to move it based on just kind of how you feel. I mean, the putter feels completely different. I'm just trying to mess around with, you know, how do I increase kind of toe swing? How do I make it a little more forgiving and make it a little more balanced? I think uh, Scotty, we moved his. I think he's got his forward. All the way front. And I'm trying to mess around with mine. I think I might move the heel in the back and move the top one up a little bit just to get a little more toe uh, swing with that. So to give you guys watching and these guys at this stage for the first time of seeing it a little bit of an education, we've got two 40 gram weights in the wings. The wings, obviously, by putting the weights all the way back, they increase the MOI. So the stability, if you strike the putter away from the center, reduction, less likely to twist. The GT Max, GTX Spider GTX that Tommy's holding on to, that has a back weight bar. You can hit some putts if you're ready. That's gonna help reduce the higher MOI to reduce the twist. With these putters that Scotty and Colin are holding on to, moving that weight, Scotty's got the weights all the way forward. That enables the putter to be, be released. Colin now has gone, you've gone one at the back at the heel, <laughs> one at, so he's playing around with the different CGs, adjustable, that obviously is known for like, a lot of the tailor-made mm, golf huh? clubs. They feel good. Uh, uh, yeah, feel like? it does feel really good. I, I, I think I need to hit a little longer of a putt to really feel the weight. When you're testing putters, you'd be looking to hit longer putts all the time or just because you want to feel that weight? No, I, I think yeah. just because I just because I move the weight, you know, it's rare that I you have the option to do that. But I, I think when you see this and have that, it's kind of you want to be able to stroke it. And it's so small, but it, it does make a difference. I think, you know, I, I felt the difference when I had it in the back versus when I had it in the front. Um, the middle m mixing around is kind of where I'm adding some variables in right now. So when we were out on the tour, a lot of what we saw was forward CG versus back CG. You've seen that in the development of tailor-made putters. Yeah, that, <laughs> that looks so good. I'm Lining up that, Tommy, does that enable you to use the true path on the top? Is that then making think, that white it, line? I think it definitely does. Like the, like I, I like, I like I these, miss. you know, the big lines on the tour response balls because I think you, it gives a little bit of freedom in using the line. I think the line's a really good thing to use, but sometimes you have to be so specific with a Correct. small line that I think the big one helps. And then just so happens that it's a nice width for the, what, what do you call this on the top? True path. True path. The other thing with I the true path, that's been, that. that's been designed with like optical engineering. So that when the eye gets <sighs> tired, you're actually going to use that much to the point you said that it can get very minute and sensitive by having the wider lines just lets the eye see it much easier. You guys were talking a little bit about the different grips that you all use. Do you use that to change release patterns or what's the vibe there? Well, you guys both, what is it there? I, I did, I've, I've, gone back, gone away. I've gone back to conventional. You used it at one point for different lengths, didn't you? Didn't length Yeah, putt. yeah. <laughs> well, yeah so I, I used to do enough, this, can't create this kind of saw putting like a... grip. Um, and then right before the open in 2021, the greens, you know, I, I had not played greens really that slow and I couldn't hit a lag putt and I, I just couldn't build the momentum. So I just went back to conventional for long putts and, and now I'm back conventional full time. Um, but you know, for me, it's, it's just finding what's comfortable and that's like, Looks as it goes good. with grip, as it goes the with like the putter, good. when you put a putter down, you want it to just sit really nicely. And I think all two of the, or these two putters, they sit very nicely, I think, for all of us when you throw it down. And that's the biggest thing is um, just not manipulating extra when you see a putter. One of the things, having done quite a bit of work with you with putters, that you will notice and you will like, and just as I'm thinking about it now, moving the weights from all the way back to all the way forward, we're seeing early can have potentially an impact on launch as I mean, well. Maybe I should do that then. Because you play such different schedules, different grass types. We're in Florida one week, we're in the Open Championship the next, and then obviously West Coast. Often we're tweaking around loft. Not everyone has that luxury. By moving weights around, you could impact that. 
So again, it's the adjustability to be able to interact with it, that you're not just got one putter that you've got to go with it. You know how finicky it is as well. You're doing it for a job. I hear it from you guys all the time. One week you're releasing it a certain way, or you've got a drill that's working yeah. doing this, and then the next it's, okay, I need a different feel. And now to your point, you don't have to come all the way off of that feel because you've got the adjustability right here. The other thing which I know you've used, Pure Roll 2, the insert, as you get to a longer putt, that's gonna help get the ball into more of a true roll. We've, we've again, looked at that with engineers and seen that downhill here, but uphill, if he's putting a bit more force into it, that true roll, the pure roll two is gonna help in that insert. So yeah, that putt there uphill, you'll start to get. <clears throat> I mean, uh, yeah, it's great when I make the putts. I just waiting for you to say something. But no, no, it just feels, it feels different um, when, I, when I move the weights. Definitely. But this is definitely one of my favorite faces. Yeah. It, it feels very, Yeah, you very, really like this good. place, don't you, Carl? I do. I was telling Tom yesterday. Well, fellas, I'll leave you guys to hit a lot of putts. Pick but it out. Pick it out. I think that's a great way to end, <laughs> mate. Done. <laughs> Thanks, mate. <laughs>